way to announce the fact I'm going to Maryland and the Chesapeake Bay on a stingray hunt. I hope you guys are ready for this one because it's going to be amazing. Uh, it's, it's, a, it's an afternoon charter. We're not going at night. But there's plenty of opportunity with this being so close that we could definitely go back another time. So this should be pretty sick. I think I'm going to get my bag in the car. And one last thing is we don't, we're not going to have the Oneida on this charter. We decided it would be a lot to pack all the bows and go. And by the sounds, they have their own setup and way they do it. So we're going to try that. And uh, maybe next time we go back, we'll take the Oneida. That'd be pretty sick. I uh, haven't really got out on the river yet with it, but as soon as we do, you guys will see that video too. So hang around if you're looking for that. But make sure you stick around for this stingray hunt because it sounds like it's going to be good. So I'm in the middle of editing and I was just watching through the clips, you know, and uh, I, I just played the clip where I shot my very first Stingray. I could not believe it. It was kind of early in the charter. Someone already got one in the boat. It was pretty sick. So definitely made me happy, you know, but I didn't quite know the buoy come off and Logan, the deckhand slash, you know, the guy's son did a great job. Thank you, Logan. Uh, <clears throat> helped me get it off. I didn't really know about the whole buoy setup. All new to me you know the whole thing so we get the buoy off it goes away and then we started pulling it in I think I'm gonna put this after that so yeah we pull it in and then you gaff it it's it's a really cool process and I'd highly suggest if you guys want to do this get a hold of scale chasers outdoors they did amazing charters I'm sure another day I'll go back and hopefully we'll get even more they said our day was not the prime like it was not the greatest day they've had so I mean I couldn't imagine it much busier than that so I'm definitely coming back and make sure you guys check out Scale Chasers Outdoors. They do amazing, they do absolutely amazing tours and uh, guide service. Make sure you check them out. But I'm going to roll the next clip and we'll pick you guys back up there.
All right, so for a little outro here, uh, if you haven't noticed, there's a little fish eye icon. That's Tacticam's polarized special fishing camera. Believe it or not, we go to get on the boat, and the uh, the captain comes out to me and says, "Do you guys mind being on film?" I go, "Oh, I actually filmed for YouTube." Right there, I met the Tacticam guy. Uh, he's a Tacticam staff member. He works full time for uh, Tacticam and does the and he was doing the fish eye. He was using it, filming with it. He gave me one. He heard I had the GoPro, and this is what I filmed on for a long time now. So he wanted me to try out his. So he gave me one, mounted it right on the side of my head, like I didn't have for you know my GoPro at the time. I really need one of them. I didn't have it. So he gave it to me, and I was looking at it. It's polarized lens, so it, it worked amazing. I liked it. All he had to do was hit a button. Five minute clips, you know, in advance, so everything from five minutes back was on camera. Uh, I really like that feature a lot. I mean, that really did it for me. But beside that and the polarized, so Rob, if you're uh, watching this right now, thank you. You really made this video what it is. And uh, hopefully we'll get to talking some more. And maybe even one day go out on our charter together. So thanks, Rob. And for everyone else, thank you for watching. Watch out for the next for the next video. It's going to be uh, Stingray Catch and Cook. I'm going to play some of the other footage that I have. And uh, you guys get to enjoy. So I'm gonna have Cody over for that. We're gonna try out. We're gonna try a couple different ways of cooking it. I've already tried the meat. It's amazing. So definitely stick around for that. But uh, any anyway, guys, make sure you like and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.